hi guys welcome back to my channel so if you are new please please subscribe and if you are a returning subscriber welcome welcome boo boo so today guys i'm going to be talking about the annoying things that you guys say to us when we just cut our hair okay let me just say it to me because they're really like um annoying let me put them that way they are really annoying so guys i have a list of videos that i have been doing about my hair the playlist is on the it's on my videos i'm just going to put the thing up here or i can just like leave the link on the description box or i can just leave the playlist at the end of this video yeah so guys remember i am four months old because i think i got my hair either may or june i don't remember but like it was the beginning of lockdown here in south africa yeah so that's when i decided to cut my hair and i explained everything why i cut my hair from them okay so the first thing that you guys ask up when we just shaved our head is like are you sick like really okay how am i supposed to answer that i'm like okay do you think i'm sick okay maybe i'm sick what if i'm really sick what if i have like cancer or i'm going through some chemotherapy and then you come in here asking me are you sick because i cut my hair like really are you gonna do that are you really gonna do that to me guys you know what you need to stop doing that because how can you ask someone are they sick just because i've cut my hair doesn't mean i'm sick I might be mentally sick i might be physically sick maybe i'm going through chemo or maybe i'm having some sort of disease that you don't know and then you come to me and be like girl are you sick no you just can't come to me and be like are you sick it's really annoying it's really annoying like just imagine if i was really sick and you're coming to me and asking me oh are you sick sis stop it and then the other thing that you guys ask um what is wrong why did you cut your hair like no man there's really something wrong she just cut her hair out of nowhere sis there's really something wrong i wouldn't just cut my hair like that but like it's none of your business sis it's none of your business okay mm -hmm. i just cut my hair because i know there's something wrong or maybe i just felt like cutting my hair or maybe i couldn't take it no more and then i decided to cut my hair but sis it's none of your business okay mm -hmm. yeah then stop asking what is wrong okay I can't boo boo. Mm. Like, I just don't like it, guys. Like, how can you come and be like, what is wrong? Yes, I did cut my hair. It's, I kind of feel like you guys make it feel like it's abnormal to cut your hair, especially if you are a girl. It's not abnormal, it's normal to cut your hair, okay? Mm hmm. And then there was this one time and then this other girl is like okay corona is really affecting you girl it's getting into you i'm like okay Jibubu, i've never been on a pandemic okay this is my first time being in a pandemic so if this corona is really stressing me i'm gonna cut my hair if i feel like cutting my hair if cutting my hair is gonna make me feel better i'm gonna cut it sis i'm gonna cut it okay so guys stop 
saying these silly things like okay it's corona we all know it's corona and everyone is going through everything just because when are you not going through some anxiety or some emotional meltdown or some men what do you call it or some mental yeah don't come to people like that and be like okay this thing is affecting you in such a way that like you even cut your hair like sis hold your horses okay hold your horses mm -hmm. and then i'm walking to town and then oh you've cut your hair I've been having that I don't know for how long everyone was like okay you've cut your hair you know cuz I think it makes people to have like um, I don't know for me it kind of made me to be like I won't go to town because people are gonna start questioning me and asking me that like why did you cut your hair and everything and then people they be like oh you cut your hair can I touch it like don't you dare don't you dare touch my skull if you wanna know how a skull feels like, cut your own hair, sis, and fall from your own hair. You can't be going around touching people's skull or scalp. But you can't be doing that. Why would you do that? Like, okay, I've just cut my hair, and then you ask me, can I touch? How am I supposed to fall? You all are, 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 are so so mean and rude and annoying at the same time you just gonna be coming to me and be like can I touch your scalp like why would you want to do that like your hands might be having corona or some germs and then you're coming to me wanting to touch my skull like imagine I'm washing my scalp every day and then you come and want to touch my skull do you know that like when I've just shaved my hair it falls um itchy every day and it f and I'd be having razor bumps and then you come to me and be like sis can I touch your scalp like really kind of feel like kissing you out because why would you want to touch my scalp respect yourself sis because i respect my scalp okay and i've washed my scalp i didn't wish it for people to be touching it so please respect yourself sis it's annoying it's really annoying okay <laughs> and then the other question you people ask um what did your boyfriend say okay sis okay mind you sis what did my boyfriend say first of all it's my hair it's my head it's my money it's my decision my choice my rules my body I do everything my way. Everything is mine, okay? Okay, boo boo. So if my boyfriend, what did my boyfriend say? Shut up. Just shut up. I'm saying just shut up because it's none of your business what did my boyfriend say and why my boyfriend should have an opinion on what I do with my hair and my head. It's my head. And stop asking what did your boyfriend do do you think he's gonna dump me because now i'm bald no this is not he's never gonna dump me because i'm bald and it's none of his business that i'm cutting my hair or i'm not cutting my hair okay mm. and then you all come and be like oh you are so brave for cutting your hair okay you see the way i'm putting those glasses these classes I know they do not um, fit um, the description or the description of my eyes because my eyes are big and these classes are small so for me to wear these glasses it shows that I'm brave okay so don't come to me and tell me that like I'm brave for cutting my hair and you wouldn't cut your hair I don't care if you're gonna cut your hair or you want to cut your hair because I've just cut my hair sis 
I said I don't care. Okay, I hope it's as one because I'm saying I don't care either you wouldn't cut your hair because I've cut my hair It's none of my business. Okay It's none of my business. So if you won't cut your hair Then don't and don't tell me that you won't do it because I just did it and after all we are not friends So I don't expect you to cut your hair because I just cut my hair and just because you're my friend, it doesn't mean that you should cut your hair because I just cut my hair. Just keep your opinion to yourself, sis. Keep it to yourself. And then you come and ask me, um, sis, but if you get a job interview and like, is there a problem? Because I've never seen any, um, law or right or wrong i don't know how to put it that says a woman shouldn't cut their hair yes i know i cut my hair bald and then when you're going to town people be up and you just in town and then someone is assuming that you are a guy and then your ask, device is disconnect and then they ask you are you a guy are you a boy or like why do you have to question me about my gender Okay, sis, wait. Is there a problem about my gender? That's me cutting my hair to find my gender. Hmm? I wanna know. Tell me right now. Does it matter that like I've just cut my hair? Hmm? Does it affect my gender in any how? Hmm? Tell me, I wanna know. I don't see any problem with cutting my hair and I don't I don't feel like me cutting my hair should make me look like a guy or every time when you see me it should make you to question my gender especially if you are a stranger and you are you just like um saw my channel or you saw my pictures and then you were like okay what is this guy doing I stop it stop it stop asking about gender stop and people do not only ask are you a girl no they ask are you a girl you gay I have to breathe in and out because I can't take it like I just can't take it why would you ask someone something like that it's so annoying okay it's so annoying do not ask about their gender please respect that like how can you even say that don't i have like boobs to show that like i'm a female don't i have them i do i'm sure i even got a big booty to show that i'm a female i know i've got a big booty okay mm -hmm. so it must show that i am um, a woman just that I just shaved my head bold okay so guys if you enjoy this video please like subscribe leave a comment down below if you're one of those people who have asked me I know I know in questions I know you wouldn't like this video if you didn't like it and you felt like I'm offending you and it was uncomfortable the things that I said, you can dislike this video. It's fine. I'll understand. Okay? Don't forget to leave a comment down below and tell me what is your experience if you have shaved your hair before about this annoying things that people say. Okay?